What motivates you to make decisions? I was just meeting with a nice husband and wife who came in for estate planning for the first time after being married for 50 years and having children uh, well into their 40s. And so I asked the question, you know, what what triggered you to think about estate planning now? And they gave a, an example that is all too common. They had a family member who was in a terrible car accident and almost passed away, was very touch and go for a while, and it made them think of their own mortality. That made me think of a story of when I was a baby lawyer and I first got out of law school. Um, I had lots of friends that I knew I grew up with, acquaintances that all had young families, and my phone wasn't ringing, so I decided, well, let me do some free estate planning for the people that I care about, and uh, I'll get a little experience, and they'll get some free uh, legal work that they could use uh, as a young family on a budget. And so I started calling everybody and I said, hey, you know, um, you guys have a two-year-old child and, you know, have you thought about estate planning? And everybody said the same thing. Absolutely, yes. You know, it, it's something we'll get to. And I said, well, hey, today's your lucky day. I like you. And so uh, with your permission, I'd like to do your estate plan for free to protect you and your children. And the, everybody overwhelmingly was like, oh, my God, that's so nice. Thank you so much. You know, send me the questionnaire. We'll get started on it. And then no one sent the questionnaire back. And I started to think like, well, maybe they don't like me. Um, and then I really started to think like, holy crap, maybe I picked the wrong area of practice because if I can't even give this away to people that already know, like, and trust me, how in the hell am I ever going to get someone to pay for legal services to draft their estate plan? And what I found was that people get to that light bulb moment in a few different ways. But once they get to that light bulb moment, they are motivated to plan their estate. Typically, it comes with either losing a friend or family member unexpectedly or almost losing them or having a diagnosis of some potentially life-threatening medical condition. Both of those things change your perspective, change your outlook, and kind of reprioritize or reorder your priorities when it comes to your estate plan. So what I found was before your light bulb goes off, I can't give away this information. I can't give away my services. Once the light bulb goes off, people are motivated and they'll pay a fair price for their estate plan. So I will ask you what motivates you and don't wait too long because the near death experience of a friend or family member may end up being your own, in which case you've missed the opportunity to plan. So hope this helps. Have a great day.